Hey guys, Dave Holloway here with Orion Welders. Uh, gonna make a quick video about the new Datto laser welder that we just unveiled. Um, kind of talk you through what it is, what it isn't, uh, where it came from, and why it's there. We've been going to a lot of trade shows over the last decade, and there is a common thread that we hear. People telling us that they love laser welders, but they're never going to afford it. It's just out of their reach, it's out of their budget. And uh, sorry to say, it took us a few years for that to click, for that to register, but it finally did. There's a lot of people out there wanting a laser welder, but at an affordable price. And so we spent a couple, couple years now developing, exploring this idea. And uh, basically, rather than designing a laser welder based on all the cool features we can put into it, we started with price being the number one goal. And we established 4,000 as a price point. And then we designed as many features as we could into that while maintaining that price point. And that's the result. The result is the Datto. Now we had to sacrifice a few of the, the fancy bells and whistles, but we did not compromise at all on the ability to make wells. People often ask, well, what's the joules? How strong is it? And that's good. That's a very valid question because every laser out there tells you how many joules it is. 60 joules, 100 joules, 140 joules. Uh, when I answer that question about the Datto, I'll tell you, I'm not going to hide anything. It's a 10.8 joule system. But what I'm going to do is give you additional explanation so that you don't go away thinking, oh, that's just a low power laser. It's not really, 10 joules doesn't tell the whole story. So here, here we'll move to the whiteboard and we'll further explore what is the data. Uh, to help do that, I'm going to draw a simple chart here. So when you weld with a laser welder, there's two variables that you control. One of them is your power and one of them is the time of the weld. Um, over here we're going to have our power and over here we're going to have our time. And I'm going to make the comparison of the data to my 60 joule laser welder. My 60 joule laser welder has a peak power of 3 kilowatts. If I turn power all the way up, 3 kilowatts is, is the value that we get. If I turn the, the, six, the 60 joule all the way on, I can keep it on for a total of 20 milliseconds. So if we work these two together, 3 kilowatts sustained for 20 milliseconds, do the math 3 times 20, that's how you get 60 joules of energy when you make a, a weld on the 60 joule machine. Let's transition to the Datto. The Datto has a peak of 1.8 kilowatts. So if you look at that, it's about two-thirds of the power of the 60 joule machine. There's a lot of power in the data. Why is it only 10 joules then? Well, the most I can sustain uh, a weld on the data is 6 milliseconds. So 1.8 at 6 milliseconds. Do the math, that, add, that gives you only 10.8. That's where it's a 10.8 joule laser welder. But it's not a true apple to apple because you can see this has a much higher peak to time than the 60 joule does. Meaning there's a lot more punch and power behind the Datto. It just lacks the ability to keep it on longer. Now, when I sit down and do any job, I kind of have my go-to starting reference point. And it's anywhere between one to one and a half kilowatts. And it's usually uh, between one or two milliseconds. Let's just go one and a half milliseconds. So we have 1.5 here, we have 1.5 here, and this is the weld. This is my starting point weld. Anytime I use the 60 joule machine, the 100 joule machine, doesn't matter what it is, that's the weld that I use when I do a jewelry repair application, more or less. You can see that is well within the area um, or the capabilities of what the data gives you. Um, but what we didn't sacrifice, like I said in the very beginning, is we did not sacrifice uh, laser welding functionality. You've got a very good capable welder uh, in, in what the Datto is. And if you look at that, what you get for what you pay, the Datto is going to be a home run for any shop that picks it up. 